basically, um, just coming in on this Wednesday, beautiful Wednesday morning, as I mentioned, to say hi, to kind of touch base with you, to check your energy levels, okay, to make sure that you've been doing the gratitude challenge, you've been saying thank you, and being thankful, and staying in a grateful place at all times, hence, you will manifest because you're grateful and you're in that place or in that space. So as we know, there's been a lot of things going on. Water is being contaminated, uh, deaths, um, just banks going, closing, just a lot of the collapse is happening. So we've been expecting it. We've been talking about it and I don't call it a collapse. Okay. I call it a reset. Let's look at it as a reset. Remember, your life is based on your perception. Your energy space is based on where you are energy-wise, conscious-wise. And so when I say to you that when I see things happening in the universe, I try not to pay too much attention to it. I pay attention so I can be in the know, but I don't spend too much energy on it, meaning I don't allow it to affect me or anything of that nature. Now, if I see something behind behind the veil, then I'm going to definitely bring it up and point it out to my melanites or my family, right? My social family. And so then that's what I do with my videos. Like I said, I, I kind of don't cover everything, but if I feel like it's affecting you immediately or affecting you physically, I'm going to give you a little warning for you to take heed. But I want you to um, understand that there's a lot going on. It is a great reset that's needed. Because what are the way that it's been, the world has been running or the way the, the programming has been, it's not beneficial to even the universe. It's hurting the planet. It's hurting the, 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 the beings in the planet. And so there was a set of beings that don't belong on this planet that decide to tear down our planet. Okay. And so it doesn't matter who you believe in, whether it be God, Jesus, Buddha, whoever. We all live in the same universe. We all live in the same planet. And so if it's affecting, um, it's affecting all of us, no matter what your, your religion is or anything of that nature. So this message can be useful for everyone. What I want you to uh, stress to you again, in spite of what you see in front of you, in spite of what you're feeling, in spite of what you're, you're going through, the important thing is to stay high vibrational. Surround yourself with high vibrational beings. Surround yourself with high vibrational things. Surround yourself with high vibrational thoughts. Be mindful of your thoughts. That's not yours. That's being given to you and programmed to you. Be mindful of what you are feeding your soul. Be mindful of what you are feeding your soul. Be mindful of what you are feeding your soul. That means every time you turn on that TV... That means every time you go on social media, every time you go on TikTok, every time you go on Instagram, every time you go on whatever, you are affected and your moods, your energy is affected by it. Protect your energy from the harvest, from the harvesters of energies. Now, our government are harvesters of our energy. 